We have Mr. Johnson, chemistry teacher, Wyoming College. <laughs> yeah, he's a favorite. Mr. Geis, biology teacher, Elizabethtown. <laughs> Mr. Griffith, I don't know where you go. Um, and the student judge is Chris Nemitz. That was really good, that was really good. So um, to start off, my name is David DeLooper. I'll be uh, hosting tonight with my partner Shane Hughes. Everybody give it up for Shane Hughes. You look good, Shane. I don't think we planned that. Um. What? You got any jokes? No, do you? I got a joke. Everyone hear a joke? Yeah. Yeah. So, um, I don't want to butcher this joke. So, um, why did the mushroom get invited to the party? Because he was a fun guy. And uh, why did the fun guy leave the party? There wasn't much room. <laughs> I'd like to say hi to Caitlin Marks. She's over there. Caitlin, please stand up for everybody. Okay, okay, you can stand up, but it's okay. Um, Caitlin was like, today during school, I told her I was doing this, and she was like, please say my name, please. So everybody give it up for Caitlin Marks. I'd like to get a drum roll. Can I get a drum roll? Oh. Hold on. Shane's gonna be coming out of center stage in five, four, three, two, one. Wearing my new latest invention, the... Woo! <laughs> 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 My new latest invention, the buckle. Shane's wearing the crimson red version, newly styled, also worn by Paris Hilton. Shane, give us a twirl, please. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Where do you wear, where do you wear this to, Shane? Where do, you, do you wear this out, to the clubs, to the discos? Please tell us. I like to wear it to the Roxy, you know, Kathmandu on the weekends. Um, Kathmandu, it's, it's a hop in place. Um, where else do I like to go? Sometimes AMC theaters, that's a lot of fun. It's very relaxing, you can hide your, there's actually a pocket somewhere. Oh, you can actually hide your own food because they don't actually let you bring your own. So if you're clever and you don't want to pay for it, you just put it in there. Those are, that's good words, good advice. She also blends in with the seats at AMC. <laughs> uh, so you just see a floating head. <laughs> you're laughing, but it's true. Look at this tribal shirt. What, what tribe did you get this from? I know many, so you should. The Zulu tribe. Where is that located? Africa. Do you know the latitude and longitude of them? No. Hmm. Mediocre. <laughs> you want to ask him some questions? I, w I would like to ask Spencer some questions. You want to, yeah, please come closer. Please. Okay. Okay. Spencer, how tall are you? 6'4. Next. How much weight wise? How much weight wise? Weight, how much do you weigh? Uh, 180 pounds. Did you ever have braces? Yes. Ooh. What color eyes? Yes. Are what color eyes? Blue. Next. GPA? 100%. Um, you'd be the per you would be the perfect candidate for a boyfriend. <laughs> mothers, mothers, if you, if you were, if you were single. Everybody just give it up for Spencer Cain. Give it up for Spencer Cain. <laughs> there he is, take a bow, take a bow. Spencer is actually an avid dancer. He wanted me to tell him, show off a little move. Okay, he'll come back later, do a little bit, little bit. okay. He'll be back later. Andrew Deuteronic, Sam Laposta, David Connor. David Connor. Mm. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Tatiana. Happy birthday to you. 
And here goes little bits of ice. Yeah, I thought they were pretty good. Yeah, perseverance. Hard work. Strength. Togetherness. Sacrifice. Virtue. Sacrifice. <laughs> that was good, though. They persevered. It's a lesson that we can all take, right? Yes. Very good. Nice. Very good. Up next are two musicians, um, very close friends of mine, who will be performing music. Um, They're Adam Barisi and Libby Ordonez. Libby Ordonez. Band. I got it. And they're, they're referred to as Adam and Libby. <laughs> so backstage, I haven't eaten anything since like lunchtime. And I was like, what if I put my microphone to my belly? Maybe it'll growl a little bit. No. no. <laughs> well, that didn't really work out. 